Amy Jackson flashes her toned abs in a crop top and distressed jeans as she joined chic pop star Ella Ear at a drinks launch party at Selfridges. Amy Jackson put on a sizzling display alongside Ella I as they attended a launch party for a drinks brand at Selfridges on Wednesday night. The actress flashed her toned abs as she cut a stylish figure in a cutout pair of white cutout jeans, which hung loosely on her hip bones. The 31-year-old paired the jeans with a black crop top and leather black waistcoat which she let fly open. The star was at the Wonder Room in Selfridges, where she was attending the Courvoisier ex Yinka Elori installation to celebrate the launch of the limited edition VSOP bottle design collaboration. The British artist has partnered with the Cognac brand to create a product which captures the sense of freedom that comes from places like Jarnac. Amy looked thrilled to be at the event as she posed for the snaps, her dark locks tied back in tight ponytail and her eyes heavily lined with a cat eye flick. Pop sensation Ella Ear was also pictured at the event as she posed next to Amy for a group snap. Ella, 29, looked gorgeous in a long white shirt dress with an oversized collar. The star put on a leggy display in the garment, which featured a black panel corset, while finishing the look with a black pair of loafers. The Came Here for Love hitmaker swept her signature curly hair back in a slick back bun, while she donned a bold red lip look and swung her Louis Vuitton bag over her shoulder. English model and activist Munro Bergdorf was also in attendance as she wowed in a figure-hugging black dress. Amy's beau at Westwick didn't seem to be present for the evening, but the pair are still very much loved up after announcing they had purchased their dream house. The star took to Instagram earlier this month to reveal they had found their dream country house, which they are now in the midst of doing up. She wrote, So we've got some news we want to share with you back in April. We completed on our dream home. We found the most idyllic country house, surrounded by greenery and fresh air to breathe, no hard feelings London. The little old lady who lived there before had called it home for the last 35 years and you can feel the love as soon as you enter the door. That being said it needed a revamp, a big revamp. We've been renovating for the last three months, and there's still a long way to go. With a hell a lot of Pinterest boards, hammers to walls, along with blood, sweat and tears, it's all part of the journey on at Nesting Tigger. Rumors about the couple began circulating in February 2022 but they reportedly began seeing one another romantically in December 2021. They met at at Saudi Arabia's Red Sea International Film Festival last December, where they were snapped chatting together at a screening during the closing ceremony. A source told The Sun in May, Ed and Amy are a really good match. They hit it off straight away.